is a space where y'all can come to after y'all been being messy all day to come back and just relax and not get attacked. That's what it is. Y'all can go be messy. I'm messy. I'll be on four different lives at one time. Real messy. But I don't bring no bones back. That's the difference. So as long as y'all go be messy and don't bring no bones back, you good. Mm-hmm. Nicole said you definitely handled this well because we had suspicions, but you never spoke on it. And I'm not gonna continue to speak on it. I said what I said. The only reason I gave y'all clarification because Cam did get up there and tell a big bold brat, a bold face ass lie. And Lady Aries, because I know you listening, while Lex was up there in that box telling you, oh, why Lex was up there in that box and you telling Lex, oh, you always got a space in my heart. Tell Lex to tell you what she said on that phone about you the other day. When she called me. Clock that. <laughs> oh. Tell Lex to say what she said about that phone, how nasty you treated her, how you act like you don't want her around, how you, have, how you got a nasty attitude and she never knew you was like that. Tell her to clock that. And, and you know I'm not lying because then she was just over there in the box the other day and y'all was talking about a movie and she you kept coming off mute saying, what is you talking about? What is y'all talking about? According to Lex. Why she telling you that you're going to be on the chopping block next? Hmm. Mm, okay. Yeah. Whole time you on her chopping block. Whole Ain't that some shit. Whole time you on her chopping block. Whole time you on her chopping block, Aries. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what she said. Aries kept saying she was like they was having a conversation and talking about something that Aries kept coming off mute. So Lex said that it seems like they already had a conversation on the back end about her being over here. And she was like, oh, you know, I support you, Dime. I told you I rock with you and da 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 this and the third. So they can't make me pick a side. But I think I'm going to have to pick a side because how they moving. It's like they already had a conversation. Oh, they made another group chat the day that the whole shit happened. Um, they deleted the other group chat they had and made another group chat and tried to add her to it, but she told them no that she didn't want to be on this, want to be in it. So is she in it now? I'm not sure, but she said she showed the not job request. Wake that up. Why y'all bitches want to sit and have conversations, public conversations, when y'all could have handled y'all shit on the back end like y'all already was doing when y'all was talking about me. Ain't Wake she the one up. that sent the messages anyway for us to know that there was back end conversations? Or I'm tripping. No, it wasn't her. Oh, okay. So I was gonna say. Okay, I'm gonna do it. What's the question, user? Because I will answer y'all questions, then we'll move on. I'm not going to address Rosé over there. Rosé looking for some motion. Rosé been having like four people win her live every single day. The most number she going to get is when HB go over there in her box and turn on her camera. And she over there talking about me and this, that, and the third. Rosé just had a whole issue with her mods or whatever. So this ain't nothing new to her. Y'all know how this mod shit go. Um, luckily I didn't fall into the trap like Rose and get inside of a discord or a group message. So a bitch can't have no receipts on me. If you want to wake it up. Somebody give security, um, no, Cam made a song about me. I ain't made no song. I ain't no motherfucking rapper. I don't know how to, yeah, yeah. I need a box. Okay. I'll drop. Oh, you about I don't to know how to make no song. Back though, you new. want to song? It don't matter. I'm going to come back up. Come right back, though, new. Right. Raider Fixer said the whole pick a side mess was created by the others and they fell into it, right? But yeah, I don't rap, girl. I don't know how to make song. You heard me singing the other night. I sound terrible. Hey, y'all. Um, I just wanted to point something out. I'll try not to be long winded with it. Um, but it's like, I've noticed that a lot of times that the word bully is thrown around to describe you, Dime, <clears throat> and how you, like, interact with people, and then how your Dime pieces are all called, like, it's a cult, and they're all mindless or whatever. But as soon as one person says something about you, regardless of who it is, literally everyone gets together. We have Rosé and, and Braid King and HB $2. Everybody flocks to that 
host a live in order to just continuously quote unquote tear you down right and to say all this stuff it's like that's not cult like behavior i don't know what it is and it's that definition of bullying it's like you could be minding your business someone like cam decides to jump in a box and say some crazy shit and now everybody's gonna take that and run with it and it's just like Bray just said that he was done with messy talk now he's in every single body's box like, i've just been bouncing around and all I see is his ass looking crazy, making faces. I'm like, I thought you're supposed to be doing hair, not being messy. And it's just so weird. It's like, how do they continuously call you a bully and call you and say that you're just such a mean person? You're like, oh, there's a bunch of mean girls when literally that's what they are, all of them. And it's just like, if you have to get every big creator on Messy Talk together in one panel to talk about a single individual who has to only herself to defend, it's like, well, that's a boss ass bitch because you don't have a whole team of people you don't have all these creators um jumping to your defense but all these other ones have to get together in order to take one person and they still don't win and it's just like and i think it's pissing them off so they have to do that like rose has no traction at all i followed her on my main for a long time and she doesn't have nobody in her box so she only thing she has going for herself is other people coming to her like to her panel to discuss you braid king it's not gonna do shit. If he's not braiding hair, he needs everyone else and your name to be attached to him and to get some motion. And it's just like them other girls, I'm mad that I subscribed to one of their pages. I want my fucking money back because I didn't know that y'all wasn't cool. Like, not like that, but I don't know them. I don't like them, I only follow them because of you. But it's like, all of them need you in order to like have some sort of platform, which is crazy. And I just think it's sad that all they can do is talk negatively about you they don't talk about the good stuff that you do and half the time you just want to have fun because all you do is laugh most of the time until someone says something anyway i know i'm talking too much but i'm just it's, it's just like a running oh, thing keep talking we always tell you that keep talking you be clocking and i'm listening yeah, that's why i'm on here go ahead girl clock it clock it clock it no yeah because it's like I cut like I look at everyone and I go to like I don't follow most of the people I just like search them up but it's like the only time most of them have anything going on like a, a good life per se it's like when Braid first started he only had all those people in there because all of y'all were in there he had every big creator in there and it created like you know traction and he's had successful lives after but only when it's somebody else's mess he can't just sit in the Thing. I've seen him with him and Trina, a couple of people. It's like 300 people in there. Nobody's giving a fuck, but let your name come up. Let them start hooping and hollering. He let his neck start snapping like he usually does. Then that's when shit starts going on. It's like all of them need you and they need each other. But it's like, if you're the bully, what does that make them? Because you don't go around searching people. You don't go around jumping in people's boxes to talk about a single individual. All of them, they have Diamond, um, Petty Row. I mean, just all the big, like like some of the big creators, most of them don't like you right now, right? They'll put them all together in a box and say, oh, I'm making shit happen. The numbers don't come because of them. It's, that's not what's going to happen. The numbers don't come because of breaking. It comes because of them. And the only reason they're all together is because they don't like you. And it's just like, why do you need that? If you're so anti-bullying, why do you continue to bully a single individual? No one goes, like, if we go into their spaces and to, to defend you, we're going to get blocked instantly. Oh, get them out of here. We don't want dying pieces down here. We don't, we don't do mindless behavior. But that's mindless behavior because you're saying, I want all the dying pieces to come in the box. But if you see a dying piece in the comments, block them. Huh? It can't be both. It's either we're going to be able to say something or not. And no one's free to speak. And yet we are called mindless. You're a cult leader when all he does is exercise cult like behavior. All he does is jump in panel to panel. Rose is the same way. Um, what's her face? Two dollars the same way. Don't nobody give a fuck about what two dollars has to say. She has to go into other people's panels or in the comment section talking crazy to get ammunition. Like she baited the fuck out of those girls. And so the breaking. I was watching that shit and I'm like, why are they answering these questions? You guys baited yourselves into a situation because you need some fucking views. Didn't even get them. And you're not seeing that they don't have anything to talk about. They're asking you these very, these specific questions so they can have something to talk about later. And they fucking fell for it. And it's just so dumb. And it's like, I don't know. It's just agitating the fuck out of me. And it's like, why do they keep saying? I don't know. I just, it's just so weird. It's like, I don't think that any of them listen to what they're talking about because from my understanding bro they supposed to be some kind of pro-woman advocate and anti-bullying what all she's been doing 
is when she goes live is that she's not putting on that makeup, which is beautiful. But if she's not doing that, she's just sitting up there with nobody in the box. But when she starts talking about somebody, it's going to be you. And it's very fucking antagonistic. And it's very much bullying. And it's very much you're not going to respond. So she's going to continue to do it. Don't nobody give a fuck about HB because let's be honest she thinks she's that bitch yeah she people give her money but we don't care about her like that because she don't talk about nothing besides negativity you know it's just i don't know it's just all of them to me just seem like they don't want to admit it and they'll continue to say that you are like whatever you are to them but if they really think about it they need you and they have been needing you especially breaking i don't know what he thought he was doing but it's just bothered me so much to see him this is the third no the fourth panel i saw him on today and all four of them would hit like your name was in his mouth which is beyond me i can't understand that but that's all that's all i had i'm sorry i know i went on for a really long time i try not to do that but i just can't control myself i guess you ain't there. You ain't. right so let me just clear something up so um and I hope that this don't whatever, but let me just clear something up because I hate for shit to be put out there on the front end um, and it don't make sense. So Cam was wherever she was talking about that somebody that was in my panel was trying to talk to her. Now, from my understanding, the only person that she had that type of situation with and knew, I don't know if you want to come up here and clear that up because let's get this straight. I don't know. I mean, besides corny and so, I don't really know none of these. I mean, in security, but new is up here at the moment. You wasn't up here, security. Um, Maybe it wasn't me. Yeah, you know. So it wasn't me. I don't know if you want to come up here and clear that up, new, but it's not the first time that I heard that. And that's what Cam is over there spewing out. Now, because <laughs> missing. I, Okay, so also I'm gonna just let me put it on the flow. I'm gonna just put it on the flow. So yeah, she was basically saying now I this why and this is why I tell y'all stop doing that. Stop. These people is crazy on this app. They're crazy. So yeah, so she said that new tried to talk to her. She didn't like new. And no, correct me if I'm wrong. She used to be hitting low up, saying that knew you was aggravating and she didn't like you and blah blah blah. But like, I'm I'm just because I, I hate for that to be put out there because it definitely was not low. Okay, not, not wrong. Aggravating is insane. She DM'd me because I don't know. I do be putting my little rainbow. I don't. Everybody be on here. They be on here for real, for real. I always put the little rainbow little shit in the chat. She DM'd me and was like, she didn't know I was, you know, that way. And I told her, yeah. And it went from there. We started, um, you know, like saying little stuff like, oh, okay. You know, I didn't, I'm like that too, but it never gave, <clears throat> it never gave want to talk to her. I feel like that was a reach, but go off whatever she said. She's definitely lying. It never, tell her just show, tell her show something. Whatever she can show, whatever she do, cause it never gave. Um, trying to talk to her, she ex. It's that's definitely a reach, cause she asked me did I like girls, which that's obvious, cause I put gay shit in the chat all the time, and it don't be gay shit. It just be rainbows, like, like what? It just be rainbows. So well, Kim, that's Kim, definitely I'm a reach. Kim. And if I didn't speak on her, why is she speaking on me? Kim, you was really over here trying to find love, nah. Cause why would you DM that girl first and then say that somebody tried to talk to you? These motherfuckers crazy. The, you know what? Why are you speaking on me and I ain't speak on you? I've been over here chilling. I ain't said nothing by Kim, so why she speaking on me? Cause you in the box, she pressed. I ain't said nothing about that girl. I don't want to say nothing about her. It ain't nothing to say about her. Well, I'm glad you cleared that up because she said that somebody in the panel tried to talk to her and you was the only one up here and that's not the first time. Why? Why? Okay, this this what I want to know. Why everybody is wanting to talk to Cam? Because first it was, why everybody like Cam? Who Cam like? 
So everybody like low. Kim and Kim don't like nobody. It definitely wasn't low. <laughs> Let's clear that like, up. Why everybody low. like Kim? Damn. Child. I told y'all, y'all gotta stay off that back. Yeah, I'm trying to see Jennifer because I be talking about everything in the chat. Girl, I be saying so much stuff in the chat and can't, I ain't never said nothing about that girl in the chat. Like, I don't even talk about her. Never. That's why I tell y'all, stay off that back end. That back end be something serious, baby. They be waiting on their moment. They be waiting on their moment to get you, get you, get you. Stay Just don't speak on me. I don't speak on you. Don't speak on me. Um, so y'all was, y'all was chatting. Y'all was talking. Yeah, it was like a converse like you know like if you find out somebody like that that you didn't know or like it's strange that you actually didn't know that they like that but they really like it for real it was more so like a conversation it never gave you the like, way you want me to hold on one second <laughs> User, what you want me to address? You keep asking me that. What you want me to address, user? Glossers. <laughs> It is a little nervous, new, but y'all don't do me like that, okay? Not too much on her. Shantae. Let me walk out, cause I do what I want. Let me walk outside. And Shante be be talking crazy about everybody with bone get in the box. I find that so odd. How you talking crazy about everybody with bone get in the box? That's diabolical, right, Lo? She be in the box. She don't ever be in the box. Even last night, she was lying about being in the box. Like, we couldn't it's see her. It's okay. I'm outside. Now, what's up, Shantae? Get in the box. User said, user said that user have told everyone that no matter how much, no, I am not taking a shower, y'all. I am running the water with the big so I can get the steam, okay? User said that no matter how many times people inbox them, that they are still going to support me. Now, who inboxing you to tell you to not to support me? Who inboxing you to tell you to that? What's wrong with y'all? Why y'all don't want you to support me? What's wrong? Y'all be y'all. That shit. Let me tell y'all. I just want to tell y'all jealousy and envy is a sin that God does not like uh 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 especially when i don't be hating on y'all because i don't be hating on y'all i don't even watch y'all support the crazy part about it is that i do not go in y'all room unless we scream in the lives bro they don't never have shit to scream anyway so i definitely don't go over there and i've been blocked her crazy ass ever since she came up here and played that video of um therapist talking about me but I don't, I don't, um, be bothering y'all. I don't be bothering y'all. I don't be watching y'all support. I don't be watching who support y'all. I really don't. I don't be in y'all business. Bro, they been got blocked, so she don't have no more shit to going on over there, but like that. I don't go in HB room. Um, I don't go in Brad room. Again, unless he hosting a live and it's something to scream over there, over there, over. You said, oh, it's nothing but jealousy. That's all it is. More people support you. That's true. But I don't go inside none of their rooms over there, but like that's another day. We have it going on. But unfortunately, they be in mine. And always worried about me. Always speaking on me. I don't get it.
Rose got a whole board over there. Um, Rose got a whole board over there doing goddamn. <laughs> Rose got a whole board over there breaking down prices for the gala, for the. And it's just like. I'm confusion. Can you break down how to get out your mama's house? No, I'm running the water Kimmy. I put the big shower tablet in the um in the thing. So I'm in the bathroom with the heat. That open me up. I'm not frying no chicken, girl. But yeah, well, they got a whole board over there trying to break some prices down. I wonder can you break down an apartment application with the application fees? Uh-uh, and all that. And Diamond needs to uninvite you from that gala while you the one sending emails, cause you harassing me at this point. It was finance rents. How do I do that? For real, she needs to remove you from that gala cause at this point you a threat cause you keep starting stuff with everybody. Somebody gonna come in and get your ass. That's what's gonna happen. It ain't gonna be me. Somebody gonna come there and get you. And it ain't gonna be me. But somebody gonna come and get you. At this point, you are a threat to the gala. Because somebody gonna beat your ass. You talk too much. Somebody gonna whoop your big ass. It might be dropped. Yeah, she is a threat. It might be dropped queen. That's gonna come to that gala and get you Rakishi. Somebody does that girl, that Mighty big breath Security, <laughs> security export said, I'm hoping it's gonna somebody know me. Yeah, somebody gonna come to that gala and get Big Show. She better stop. It is truly asinine that y'all would jump. <laughs> Who be saying asinine? You said I watch WWE. Yes, I do. I love WWE. They used to come down here to the um, Miami Arena. I don't know if they still do it, but I went maybe like I went three years. Y'all don't know who Big Show is? Welcome to the Big Show. Y'all don't know who Big Show is? He used to wear that um little onesie with the skinny scrap. Hell yeah, I know who Big Show is. The Undertaker, all of that big ass. Yeah. You watch it too, yeah. But they gonna get Big Show. Big Show better stop. You love the word asinine. Hulk Hogan, yeah. She needs to stop that for people though, but she's have but she become a threat at the Galilea. Hold on. No, you gotta put the whole, put the whole, um, um, body, body up. So they can really see who Big Show is. Put a whole, like a fur back picture with them bad knees that he got. Ray Mysterio. <laughs> Not Ray Mysterio. Cause you always have to be in people's business. You, you, if your hair, if them little tweeds on your head grew, but every time you say you connect this, yeah, I usually get one from Trader Joe's and put it over the shower thing, but if them little runs in your head grew for every time that you was in somebody's business, your shit would be down your back. Yeah, for real. So any other questions before we move on? Because we had a lot of shit to recap today. This was not a part of the recap, y'all. This was not planned. This is not a skit. Uh, none of that, okay? Hi, is what a picture. Okay, hold on. Hold on, let me go get another one. It ain't working. Ha, 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 ha. 
You said her camera don't be zoomed in, but you can still only see her face. Yeah. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Please. I didn't even do it. Damn told me to. Hi, let me go ahead and rotate you, babes. <laughs> You're up out of here. I had to find one with the bad knees, y'all. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Hi. I'm going to rotate you. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Black whoever that is, y'all. Mr. Mississippi. Mr. What is it? Pulling up, but I don't see they comment. Something about Randall. I remember they said that you were more useful when you were on the Randall live. Imagine skating your ass over here to come tell me that just for you to get skated right on up out of here. Make it make sense. Why don't y'all learn? <laughs> yeah, Kira, you want to come up and say it? I can switch. I can rotate for you. Either KG, they got him up out of here before I could say something. So anybody else have any more questions? Anything that y'all want me to answer that y'all want me to clear up? Again, like I said, I tried to keep it as cute as I could, but unfortunately, a lot of people on this app don't know how to keep their mouth closed. And just the same way how people was coming in here asking questions, y'all could have just ignored it. Oh, yeah, um, the same way how people was coming in here asking questions, let um carry up, y'all. Um, how people, and it's been happening, y'all. This not a whole week done passed by since this shit happened. And I still didn't say anything with this whole week. Two weeks. Yeah, two, yeah. And I haven't said nothing. I haven't addressed nothing. And they still just, it's crazy. What's up? Um, I don't know if it's Kari or Carrie. It's I Kari. It's hey, y'all. Happy Sunday. Thank you. So this is like my second time up in a panel and I, I low-key be nervous, but I know I ain't got nothing to worry about with y'all. Um, <laughs> but I just wanted to say, I'm sorry that that happened. I can only imagine how disappointing, you know, that is. Um, Cause you know, it's been a lot on this app with you and just us supporting you. Um, and I just hope that you continue to remain encouraged. I know you're, you're strong, the panel strong, all of us are strong. And I just want to say that I really appreciate what we do have here. And sometimes we do have to weed out the ones that aren't really about, you know, supporting women and supporting each other. Um, but I love this space and I try to be here every day. Y'all help me get through my eight to five. <laughs> um, but I'm just sorry that, you know, that, you know, stuff just keep popping up. Um, but I just love how you do handle things. And I think you're doing your best low all y'all and i just i love it i'm here for it you know i'm here to support i'm a girl's girl in a good way because i know sometimes um being a girl's girl it's a lot of negativity around that even coming up now but i just i want to support you know uh, y'all the way that i can i'm trying to grow i'm just all about positivity and just being a better person than who i was yesterday and i feel like that's what you know the dime pieces that's what we all represent and you know i just want to keep that 
you know, in mind out there. I think you're doing great. And that's all I wanted to say. I know it's just been a lot of negativity, but I think you're doing great. And, you know, once we get all the people that have other motives or whatever out, I think, you know, we'll, we'll be out there even more. So that's all I wanted to say. I don't know how to drop either, but, <laughs> and then I did tell you about the sinus rents too, because my sinuses flare up a lot, but go to CVS um, and try like a neti pot or those little sinus rinse things. It uh -huh. sucks, but it works. I promise. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate the words of encouragement. Um, I appreciate you being honest. Um, and I appreciate it. And I, and I honestly feel the same way. Like I said, y'all, on the back end, um, on the back end, all of us, that's still left and it's still about 30 people probably maybe a little bit less i can't count the exact number but it's still a good amount of us and we don't be arguing uh, i'm gonna say it again i'm gonna say it as many times as i feel like it need to be said all of the arguments came from them arguing with each other not from arguing with us the only person that they got into it with actually was low <laughs> why is you taking out my baby school clothes <laughs> why that's what you want her to wear to school tomorrow why is you taking out her school clothes look your sister picked your school clothes out yeah that's what you wear tomorrow too the same shoes um that's on you but um yeah so the only person that they did get into it with was a low but that was the day of when the little situation um ended up happening right it had nothing absolutely nothing to do with me or us they have not ever been to it with anybody else if they have ever felt the way they haven't said it or anything like that yeah or anything like that so i would never know but i just know that it had nothing to do with me why they felt the need to gossip about me on the back end yeah my test you can come up um i'm really not sure Somebody um drop Carrie. I think she was on. Um, yes, please, thank you. <laughs> but yeah, why they feel the need to gossip about me on the back end? I don't know, but it's cool. It's cool. I don't care. I'm still thriving. Mad at me is crazy because I did not do nothing to nobody. I don't care when I bring get down to fifty people, ten people. Long as it's true, genuine support. That's it. Hey, hi Don. How are you, honey? I'm fine. And you? Good. Low panel and everybody. Yeah, I. I hi, low. I said I, I noticed it a couple days ago, and I and they were saying a few things. I can't remember everything, but my eyes kind of like was tripping, and so I wanted to DM you guys. But you know, we all talk on here, but we don't actually know you, so I didn't want to feel like I was fan, you know, fanning, and I'm in y'all inbox. But I definitely wanted to say what was going on and I don't know why I didn't feel comfortable because you guys definitely you know make us comfortable you know so mm -hmm. I, I just wanted to say that I wanted to DM you so bad Dime. it's okay uh, it's okay I understand I respect y'all respecting my boundaries because I'm not gonna lie I probably would have never responded because I didn't even want anybody who did start supporting them to not support them just because of me you feel what I'm saying yeah um I wanted everybody to get to know them. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm so stuffy, y'all. I'm out of breath. But I wanted everybody who, you know, did follow them, even if it was in support of me, to get to know them, you know, and see if they like them. A lot of people, as they said before, they was, um, so who that was in here just said, I didn't like them. I just followed them because of you. Somebody said that somebody was like, they didn't like them. They didn't like their space. When I used to be over there, even in the comments, a lot of people would be like, oh, when are you going back to the gazebo? So I just said, I said, stop asking me that. Sorry. Yeah. It would have been just looking out. I would have, I would have presented it to you like, Dom, I just got a question. I noticed something funny and that's all I would have said, but I did notice okay. it and I appreciate you for letting me up. Uh, and, um, yeah, that I'm security a, I'm who said that security was like she didn't like them she just was over there because i was over there and you can tell the difference when i go into their room they never shoot up when i'm gone they have 10 12 people over there and that's probably fine with them because i'm okay even if it was the same amount in here but don't be trying to make it seem like as if somebody did something to y'all because that's not what happened if that was the case the whole trip would have been canceled i did refund everybody 
Hold on, I'll tell y'all that in a minute. But go ahead, Montez, because I'm doing something. Okay, okay, I'm finna do okay. it. No, but I was just gonna say, yeah. And at first I thought it was because, you know, sometimes when you leave or go to work or Lowe's busy, then the other girls, like when we end in the live, the other girls, you would say, you know, y'all gonna keep the live going. So at first I thought that until I saw Brad in the box. And then that's when I was like, okay, no, no, something ain't right. And I just moved on. But as um, soon as you said that when I came in the live, I just blocked them all because I'm not for that. I'm not no, no. And I understand you saying, you know, you want everybody to be, um, neutral and normal but i i just feel like if i'm supporting one person then that's who i'm supporting and if if i noticed that these people were supporting you and now they're not then that's not right it's not right but um i love you guys you guys have a good rest of your day and i'm in back to the comments okay. you're welcome and i do know how to drop <laughs> <laughs> now okay okay so I did get in earlier and I was like, what is going on? What did I miss? I, the last I heard was the live got dropped. We was in here and laughing at whatever this morning, the live got dropped. I come back after finishing this last minute school shopping and diamonds going off. Yes, I did notice that they was going live at the same time. I noticed they wasn't over here. And I really didn't think nothing too much of it because I really don't be paying attention to that. But then when I I peeped that it was another time that they was on at the same time, I'm like, interesting. I was over there earlier today. There wasn't nobody saying nothing crazy. So again, it didn't even ring no bells or had me thinking no kind of way. So when I came in and they and Dime was going off, I'm like, what even happened? And again, like like Dime said, she ain't had to speak on it. It happened a while ago or a week ago, two weeks ago, whenever it happened. And that's cool. Shit, she ain't got to tell us nothing. But I just came in and she was going off. So I was like, what happened? And then she talked about, don't ask what happened. I'm like, well, damn, I'm catching strays. And I just walked in the room. So I'm sitting back, just trying to figure out what the hell going on. I think it's shady as shit that they got certain people in their panels and they hopping in certain people's panels. I'm not going to say no names. Y'all know who I'm talking about because I ain't got time for the foolishness. But ain't no way in hell. Even if Dime do something or say something and I'm like, you know what? I'm cool on her. I'm not fooling with her no more. Ain't no way in hell I'm hopping in these people panels who talking about unaliving her kids or uh, doctor her job and all this other shit. I, that, that's some crazy ass mess. But that's, that's, that's all I got to say. I'm, 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 I'm in here. I'm a dime piece. I be clueless. I'm really out here just living my life. I be putting the, 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 the lives on and grocery shopping, cleaning my house. I come back and who knows what's going on. So just, you know, I'm, 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 I'm with the shits, but I ain't with that shit. That's it. That's all. That's the post. Yeah, so... That's what it is. So everybody who didn't know, like again, I'm not blaming nobody. Um, of course, people who knew, they're gonna send me screenshots. So people who probably didn't know what was going on, you know, inside their panel and stuff or whatever, right? Hold on, y'all. Give me a second. Tap the screen, y'all. Let's power tap to 150, but let's work on 175K on the taps. Gift the host, gift the panel. Thank y'all for gifting the panel, seriously. Um, if you can gift, that's perfectly okay, but make sure you double tap in. Grab you a sub if you don't have one, because I see some naked bodies down there. And grab you a heart me, because those are cheap. Even if you can't get a sub, get a heart me. They're only one cent. Okay, we love y'all real bad. Stay tuned, because we still got the regular tea, the street tea to get to. This just our, no, our tea. We haven't even got to the street tea, so buckle up, buttercups. And I said this from the get beginning, it's always low, period. Period, thank you, because they...